students. Our lesson for today is nine, uh, Unit 9, Section D, Tourist Information. Look at the picture here. These are the Tarshan temples in Malta. Now, think about, would you go and visit this kind of place on holiday? Why? Why not? Okay? It depends if you like historical places. Okay? So that you can study history, maybe. And why these uh, places are so important to be visited by different tourists. Okay, think about that and write your answer in exercise number one. Now, exercise number two says, there is information missing in the brochure. What questions can you ask to get the information? So here you have got a brochure, the Tarshan Temples in Malta, information for visitors. This is a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The four Tarshan Temples are around 5,000 years old. Address, Neolithic Temple Street, Tarshan. Opening times, open from. Okay, so you have to ask for the time there or the day, okay? And then we have tickets, book in advance or buy at the entrance. Adults, we have five euros, six euros for adults, 12 to seven year olds, seniors over 65 and students. And then you have to find the, to ask for that information in order to find out, okay? And then we have children, three euros, infants, five and under, it's free. Official guided tour, 20 euros with a tour guide and lasts, so we don't know, we have to ask about that. Transport to the side, buses every hour from the, okay? So we have to, al to ask also about this information. And the answers could be, okay, one, or what time does it close? How much does it cost to go in for a student? How much is it for students? How long does the tour last? Where do the buses go or leave from? And wh where can I catch the bus? Okay, these are the questions. Then you are going to read the script. The script is this one. Exercise number three says, complete the information about the Tarshan temples. Okay, you have got a conversation um, between the one who gives information, tourist information, and then a bit, and the tourist. And you have got the, the dialogue here. I have underlined the expressions, the key expressions, which you have in the book. Expressions for requesting information and for suggesting information. So for requesting information, I'm interested in visiting do you know the opening times? What time does it open or close? Could you tell me the price? How much is it? Is there any public transport? How often does the bus go? Then suggesting options. How about with ING? How about going? Okay. You can also, another option is to, or you could take. Now, I want you to notice the use of could. Could you tell me the price is for uh, requesting polite information. A polite request, huh? and then uh, su uh, for suggestion, you could take. So you could take, which is in the is the last expression, uh, or you could take. So in this case, I'm using could for suggestion. Okay, uh, this is the thing that I wanted you to focus, and then. You have got to complete, so after you read the script, you are going to complete the brochure here. And then after completing it, you will take a picture of that and email me uh, the picture. Here you have got the uh, uses of could. And then the homework we is prepare conversations about journeys and places in your own country that you know about. Using the expressions you studied. Okay, prepare just one conversation using the information um, that you have, but also using the um, uh, expressions for requesting and suggesting uh, information, suggesting options and requesting information, okay? And don't forget to complete also the workbook. And you are going to send me a photo of, also to your, of your workbook, okay? With your homework. 
uh, this was the lesson for today uh, see you then